y'all want a day already. Y'all see all that stuff in the back? <sighs> I have to move my stuff and get it out of storage. So what I'm doing, guys, is... Oh, y'all. I think I put too much loose in my hair today. Get my hair back braided. But anyway, I got my stuff out of storage. And I knew that I had more clothes in there, guys. I need, I need my clothes. Even my winter stuff, Okay. So that's what I got. Clothes. I had some of my, my Uncle Macy stuff. His blankets and things. I just I just really need to keep that stuff. You know, just sentimental reasons. But I need to keep it. So I have someone who's right behind me driving at you all, man. You know what? Right behind me and that you all man right there. So what we're gonna do now is go and give this stuff to Salvation Army. That's what we're going to do. But there's one in um, you said take it to one in Broward County that is in Fort Lauderdale. Yeah. 1901 West Broward Boulevard. So that's where I'm on my way to drop off the stuff so yeah guys I, I mean I really didn't want to get my catch away my little love seat my love seat I've had for a very long time and I love my I love it but what am I gonna do with it even though honestly I, I really could have I really could have fit it in my apartment but I don't want to overcrowd my apartment so and I definitely definitely don't want an extra bill you know a month when it's just not necessary because it just wasn't that much stuff in there so that's why it's out now damn i don't know what they doing railroads okay it's back open stay tuned anyway y'all stay tuned up cut ups i know it's been a while since i did the outfit of the day for you guys so that's what i'm gonna do today so i'm outside and i'm doing the outfit of the day for you guys and this is another one of my tie-dye outfits I got from Amazon. I got the matching shoes from Walmart. Hope y'all can see. But so this is the outfit of the day, everybody. And this is a size small because I wanted it to fit. Okay. <laughs> outfit of the day. Walk it out a little bit for y'all. Turn. Walk it on now. Whoops. Hey. 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 Have a little fun today. Yeah, so I basically had to um just get rid of the storage bill. <laughs> yeah, get rid of that damn storage bill first off, y'all. That's an extra bill I ain't got to pay now. And um, just put my things, um, well, just gave them to the Salvation Army. So I'm done with that bill. And guys, I have to tell y'all about these shoes that I have on. I got them from Walmart. I think they was like $7.86. They are so lightweight and so comfortable, everybody, y'all. I can't really, let me see, I can do this though. Cause I wanna hold, I gotta hold on to something. I wanna show y'all these shoes. I mean, just super lightweight. Super, super comfortable. I mean, you can wear these just around the house for house shoes, um, to the beach, anywhere. Um, just anywhere. They just so super comfortable. Now I think on uh, Old Navy they call them uh, foamies because they so 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 lightweight. But yeah, guys, I love them. So I'm gonna go back and get them in every color, every color. Yeah, 
It's really nice out here today. Kind of hot though, a little bit. But it is what it is, guys. Probably go find me something to do, something different a little bit later. But right now, I'm just enjoying being out here in the sun, even though I'm hot. Look at my face, y'all. I have a little wig on today, y'all. I'm gonna get my hair braided tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> got my guy. Got my guy who is unloading and getting everything set up and done. You done? Ready to go? Okay, he cool, y'all. Okay, y'all. All right, stay tuned. Let me see what you did. Yeah, he did that quick. He wasn't fucking around. Wait, wait, wait. Let me see that. Okay, hold on. Now you really want to play, was you? Damn, okay, okay. <laughs> I heard that shit, okay. Okay, so some of the stuff actually is being dropped off at the guy that helped me with this little adventure. Some of the stuff is being dropped off at his girlfriend's house, which is cool with me. He wanted some stuff, guys, so I already got the damn van. So he wanted some stuff for his girlfriend. That's his girlfriend over there. So why not let him get the shit? I gave him a big screen TV, um, a fan, picture shit why not so let him he helped me with the shit so why not keep the shit help somebody else out he helped me right exactly so i sure appreciate that so so people well i know at salvation army they at army they're not gonna give it to the people but at least they got some so i'm cool with that this girlfriend is actually really nice, guys. This girlfriend is really nice. Her and her girlfriend. I guess they kind of, you know, kind of having hard times, you know. And um, him and his girlfriend are, are staying with, uh, I guess, his girlfriend's girlfriend. And I know what that shit's like, y'all. I, I know what it's like. I've been there, done there, done that, you know. I, I have. Shit, I don't, don't ever think I'm better than nobody. And I, I don't ever, ever, um, you know, I think that somebody else's situation is, is so sad and sorrowful and, 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 I'm better or, you know, I just, I just don't think that way, guys. I mean, I guess because I just know from experience how hard it can be sometimes. And that's just life, you know, life sometimes, oh my God, it, it don't always be a box of chocolates like Forrest Gump said, right y'all? <laughs> it's not always a box of chocolates. Sometimes you get some some chocolate covered pits. Right guys? You get some chocolate covered pits with no cherry at all. And it just be hard sometimes. So Yeah, I've had to stay with people though. I know what that's like. Relatives, friends. You know, so I know what it's like. But, you know, thank goodness they really weren't all that far away from me. Not really. Because I'm, I'm back on A1A, not too far from my place. So, yeah, gonna get it together. Okay, guys, stay tuned in anyway. Today has been an adventure, everybody. But I'm at the U-Haul, even though they said I gotta put shit, two or three gallons of gas in the damn tank so now i gotta go back to the damn gas station you know you gotta put the gas back in the in the truck after you use it so back to the gas station y'all but at least it was kind of a smooth little move today it wasn't bad 
It was three fifty-five. It wasn't bad. It wasn't bad at all today. Whew, like I saw. I'm not real hungry, but I know I should be getting hungry in a little bit. Maybe find something down here. Oh Lord, y'all know what a pain that be. Shit. Maybe I go home and make some, right? I know people see it. <laughs> Since I be having so much bad luck, uh, ordering food and shit, you know that maybe I need to cook more. Maybe y'all right. Maybe that's a sign, you know? Damn. Yeah, I should drive those people. Wee. Mm, right? You know what? I do have some flounder. I, maybe I'll make that damn flounder. I do have some flounder. And I've been saying I was going to make it for the longest, y'all. Maybe I'll just go ahead and make it. Some flounder and some broccoli. No, I can't make it because I said the next time I cook, well, I guess I can cook it and then just eat it somewhere else. Because I said I wasn't going to do no more recipes until I got my curtains. And I don't get my curtains until tomorrow. Maybe I'll just make the damn flounder and just eat it. Yep, I think I'm going to do that, y'all. Maybe. We'll see. Stay tuned. So, y'all, the cool white boy and stole my damn credit card, y'all. Stole my shit. Played his motherfucker self. Yeah, stay tuned in for that story, y'all. Man, it's some shysty motherfuckers here in Florida. I tell you, who is some shysty motherfuckers here? Y'all, let me tell you how. And you know what? I thought he was so cool, y'all. And he was. It's just that it was in front of his face. He saw the opportunity and he took it. And y'all, I know what it's like because I've done it too. But I'm driving. So let me get somewhere. I'm on my way home. Let me get home, y'all. And break this damn story down to y'all. Dumbass. I couldn't even wait till I got home. I mean, stole my shit, y'all. The thing is, though, I got multiple accounts attached to that one card. But the main account that's attached to it, that's attached to it, it got 67 cent in it. Because as soon as I knew he stole it, I moved the money out of it. Real quick. Real quick, I moved that money out. So, yeah, guys, I mean thought he was cool see there y'all but i'm not dumb though far from it okay but i do know what it's like when something right there in front of your face you know especially a motherfucker like that thought he had it made in the shade and took advantage of that shit dude took it <laughs> dude probably thought i had money and shit just by coming to my place and stuff too because he had to take some things there guys you know my clothes and stuff so come in there, he probably thought I had money. <laughs> oh, shit. But to a street person, you know, they probably really thought they had it made. Well, he did. He thought he had it made. Yeah, I can't believe that. Get in here, yes, I can. This Florida shit. Don't nothing here surprise me, okay? Nothing. <sighs> These motherfuckers here. Oh yeah. Mm. What the fuck? Sand. Sand. So I got sand. Ugh. Sand all in between the toes. I ain't even been on the damn beach. Might as well go to the beach. Got sand all in between my toes. Ugh. Yeah, ain't that a trip? Stole my shit. Anyway, y'all, how it happened, I have a lanyard from a phone, black one. And the lanyard, for, for the people that don't know what that is, it's like a, like a, like a rubber necklace, you know, and it's stretchy. And, uh, you know, it's for, it's for my phone. I put my phone on when I wear dresses that don't got pockets, even though this dress do got pockets. But I just like, I like it, you know, sometimes not being able to um not having to hold my phone all the time carry it around all the time so just put it around my neck like a necklace and um i had it right here right there y'all i had it right there and i had bought dude some beer 
okay? We got to the U-Haul, and me and the man from the U-Haul truck standing outside talking, and dude had pulled the truck up, you know, because the guy told him where to park it, and he pulled it up and parked it there. Dude grabbed his stuff out of the truck, right? And he walked it over to my car. My car was locked. Every time I get out of my car, I lock it. So the car was locked, but I unlocked it. But I was talking to the dude that worked there, remember? So I unlocked the car. Dude put his shit right here. Now, what I'm about to show y'all is a pair of pants I had bought Ken a long time ago. I don't know what Ken was waiting for to wear them or whatever. But anyway, he never did. So I gave them to this man. Some cute jeans right here. These are jeans, guys. But anyway, and I bought the man some damn beer. Damn alcoholic, okay? It's messy, but here go his shit right here. Y'all, and he put his shit right here in the front seat. So, off top, he saw that fucking credit card right here. Okay? And took the shit. Thinking he was on the come up. That's what happened. <laughs> so, then the man tell me that I need some more gas in the car. So I tell this man, I said, listen, my credit card gone, man. Where's my credit card at? Okay. I'm trying to be cool at first. I'm trying to. Where's my shit at? You know, because you ain't getting paid, dude. But see, the thing is, he heard me say that I had some money earlier. It's cash. And he was like, well, I thought you said you had some cash with you. I said, no, dude, I, I sure don't. I said, I was going to have to get the money off the car to pay you. So, you can't get paid now. I ain't got my car. Y'all got money. Cash. So, I'm no fucking fool. My cash right here. Okay? <laughs> Mama ain't no fool. Okay? I know I'm around, or I knew that I had picked up a street person, okay? Not crazy. But I ain't think it was gonna be that, that, that thirsty. Not that thirsty, but she just can't underestimate people. Because obviously, yeah, he was. <sighs> Again, man. But anywho, yeah, yeah, ain't that a bitch? Anyway, uh -huh. okay, that's that's what happened though. Anyway, yeah, play this motherfucker self. Though. The day is over, and I'm glad. I just came from a little walk on the beach and just wanted to unwind. I'm just thinking about how dumb people can be, you know. That man did all that hard work and, and all this heat and ended up playing his damn self. I just, I just can't get over it, you know? So stupid. Don't get me wrong. I'm inconvenienced too, but mostly everybody got cash app. And as long as they got that, I don't need that card. I need that $200 to get my hair braided in the morning, but everybody at that shop got cash app, so I'm straight. So, yeah, just messed up, y'all. You can't trust nobody. Not even the most um, innocent uh, what you may think is an innocent, harmless street person. You can't trust nobody. So, yeah, y'all. But anyway, I'm glad this day is over with. <clears throat> I'll see y'all. Shit.